Okay, so I have, uh, right now what we're gonna do is install a wire harness for a 2013 Land Cruiser. For some reason, uh, all the YouTube stuff ends at 2002, and these are really kind of hard to find. So this is, um, I believe this is all original, or um, uh, this is all Toyota equipment here. Um, this is a connection for a wire harness that I, I bought directly from the Toyota parts store. Uh, for some reason, down here you can see they have the um, this uh, ball hitch receiver, but there's no um, nothing to plug it into. So I'm going to show you under the car how we're going to plug this in, and uh, then we'll test the trailer. We'll probably do that offline because I don't know if these lights are going to work. But this is something that I think I can do myself. You can stop it. Uh, um, these, these are the um, the plugs that we're going to plug the, uh, the switch into. I am on the passenger side, um, back near the spare tire. So first we're going to pull this off, which is a little tricky. I just have to give it a, it's the hardest part, getting these pieces out. But you can see the receivers are ready here. So I guess the question is, it probably doesn't matter which one I do first, because the vehicle's not on, of course. I'm just gonna try and plug that one in. And plug in the second one here. Daddy, all I see is your arm. Okay. So one snapped in a little bit easier than the other one. Let's see if I can. Get it in there. <laughs> Alright, I hear a click and you can see they're both in there. I might come back and double check that. And uh, no, this neatly tucks right up here. So you, see, you can see this bracket came right with the uh, harness. And there's the pre drilled holes. So there's no, I'm not a car guy in the sense that I do this sort of thing regularly. So uh, it does come with these bolts and um, which we call it, do you have that bolt there? All right, well, anyhow, it comes with the, the screws and, and bolts to pop in there. So I'm just gonna hand tighten to set them. All right, so you can see got a nice seven, um, seven pin adapter here ready to go it's got some spring action on it but our trailer is a four pin so i picked up this other piece i'll put again i'll put the parts in it this is going to snap in and it actually locks right in there for your four pin adapter um so it's pretty uh pretty much going to be the easiest part like you're done okay 